everybody, I'm Carrie Fairneck, and we have another exciting episode of Convene TV brought to you by PCMA and produced by CNTV. Editor-in-Chief of Convene Magazine, Michelle Russell, is here to give us some insight on some exciting topics impacting meeting professionals today. Michelle? Thank you, Carrie. I do. We have a really exciting June issue lined up for our readers. We talk about two things that are near and dear to planners' hearts in this issue, which is sleep and their salary. So sleep is important because I think for a long time, um, it's been accepted that when you come to a conference, you're just going to go, go, go. And you're just gonna have to expect that you're not gonna get a lot of sleep and that you're gonna leave and you'll probably be exhausted. There are things that we should do with the program, with the schedule that gives uh, attendees more of a break, gives them a chance to take a breath, um, maybe even take a nap. We interviewed some planners who have nap pods um, on their exhibit floor to give people a, a chance if they want to sleep or just rest or just sort of be in this kind of cocoon um, where they disengage a little bit. And um, also some tips for planners on how to make your, your schedule a little more sane while you're on site. You mentioned sleep and salaries and convened salary survey results are out. So what can meeting planners learn about their own salaries and how can they use this information to their advantage? Planners use the salary survey to negotiate for a raise because we have uh, such detail that they're able to see what planners in their geographic area are making. They're able to see what planners with their level of experience are making. They're able to see what planners with a CMP are earning compared to those without a CMP. And it's, it's pretty significant. It's more than $10,000 annually. So it's a really great tool, one of our most read articles every year for a very good reason. That's a pretty good reason. All right, moving on to Convenes, there's a meeting for that series. What are some of the shows that you all are featuring? So far this year, we have covered the Awards and Recognition Association International Awards Market, the National Demolition Association, Convention and Exposition, World Sword Swallowers Day, there really is a meeting for everything and even a meeting for meeting planners. So let's talk about the one that's right around the corner, PCMA's 2015 Education Conference. It is um, June 14th through 17th and we're going to be in Fort Lauderdale, Florida. And we've got a great lineup of speakers and uh, education and networking. It's just, it's a really nice, um, event every year that's sort of like a mini version of convening leaders. You know, I can't wait for it. I will be in Fort Lauderdale and I'll see you there. So Michelle, thanks for your time today. Thank you for having me, Carrie. And everyone go to PCMA.org and make sure you take advantage of our great content. That'll do it for us. I'm Carrie Fairneck with CNTV. Thanks for watching this edition of Convene TV brought to you by PCMA.